So now we're going to set up a continuous local anesthetic infusion. So what we need to do is make sure we're in the right mode. So in order to do that, you go to options, go to delivery mode, put in your password, which is the 2217 postcode. Press OK. You'll be prompted by a selection where it says epidural. Click on that, it will give you two options. So the two options, it will say PCEA, and this is what we would select for a continuous infusion as opposed to an intermittent, which is for program intermittent boluses. So we select PCEA for continuous. We go to new infusion, a volume to be infused. So if you have a bag that has been primed, you would select 90. Otherwise, if it's an additional bag, you would choose 100. Your continuous rate, in this case, refer to your prescription, which was eight mils an hour. Okay. D bolus stands for demand bolus. So if it's continual rate, there's no demand. As it, the demand bolus refers to as if it was a PCEA, where it has a handset where a patient could press. So we select zero. We do not require a loading dose, so we select no. We confirm with a second RN the program details, the volume to be infused as 90 mils, the continuous rate as eight mils an hour with a demand bolus of zero. Okay. Then you press start, making sure it is connected to the patient. It prompts you, would you like to prime before we start? We don't need to, as it's already previously been primed, so we can press start. So when it's running, it will have a big bold number that it's running at a continuous rate of eight mils an hour. In the second box here indicates volume to be infused, which is 90, and how much has been infused in total. So 0 0.1 mils has been infused so far of the 90 mils, and it will count down with the time left.